here across the Ross River Bridge and down to the Cooper Sweep for the first time. In car with Brock Feeney. There's Bloxham. Oh, oh three, three wide. But oh, he's got to get spun here by Gordia. So Blocky went down the inside. Three wide. Just hold it there, Brock. That's a fair bit of damage, mate. It was never going to happen. Three wide. It's tough enough. Two wide through there. And Feeney comes out the worst. In fact, Bloxham has. He's on the other side of the Coates High corner. What a shame. He charged his way through the field from outside the 30 to a top 10. Here's Lockie crabbing down the road. So, Gordia was the meat in the sandwich here, I think. Yeah. There's a replay of the start. And Kostecki indicating to the left, but would have to slot in behind. Cam Wilson on the run down to turn number one of the BP Ultimate replay. Here it is from Bartholomew. This will be interesting to watch. He's up to 16th position already from 29th on the grid. OK, yeah, good launch. And he'll pick his way through the pack. We picked him to win the race before the clutch trouble. So, look, where he's just going where the other cars are. He knows if he uses a bit of pavement that they're not going to use, he's has just half a chance to drive around a lot of them, which he's going to do. He'll just cruise down the outside here, switches back to the inside. Has another look. If he gets this stop, he does control. Oh, oh maybe not. No. OK. There was Dremel. There was Dremel. So just a little bit op opportunistic there by... You watch him come through the 95, and it's the next group of cars. So Yeah, he wasn't going to make the corner. So you know, it's a hard thing to do. You come off the back of the pack. Who's this with Brock Feeney? So this will tell us what happened going down into turn number five. So it started back here with a slower That's Bex car. there. Now, he'll pull to the outside. Oh, Lockie Blockson's got a big run, a huge run. <laughs> Gordia's trying to give everyone room, and there just isn't enough room for three cars to go through there. And really, um, Brock was just the car caught on the outside. So, Feeney on the yeah. outside here, so he comes in, contact with the 96, and up on two wheels. They got some airtime in the motorsportsales.com.au entry. And we'll see Bloxham fire off to the left-hand side at the Coates High corner as Feeney bounced his way across the curb to the inside. And Gautier would spin as well. It's just one of those things you get... Gautier's the meat in the sandwich, just trying to stay off for Let's see where Brody did the pass. Tyres did the job there. Yeah, It'd be good to get a replay and see where Brody pulled the move on Cam. So while that was happening, it puts... Here we go, we're going green. Back into the lead. And a very quick Vodafone safety car period here.